Welcome to the channel, Excellence, where we strive for excellence. We strive to be one better than what we were yesterday. Why? Because we can be the best we can be. Now, let's talk about the laws. The laws of life. Who make the laws? Do God make laws? Is there universal laws that governs all events? See, God gave us laws. The universe gave us laws to live by. But man tried to make laws and break God laws. See, that's what it is. See, man has made his own law against God's law. Know that. See, ask Jesus. Jesus demonstrated universal law but why did he have to be a felon? A convicted felon. See, y'all remember Jesus was thrown in jail and was crucified with two other men that were all accused of the same crime. <laughs> and that's law, man-made law. Universal law governs all events. I follow God's law. See, when man made a law, it was made to be broken. You have to see what's on the other side of that law that man made. See, man made that law to keep you out so he can stay in it. See, any law that man made is for him. It's best suited for his growth. Why you think law changes all over the world? Universal law governs all events. I'm going to give you a serious law right now. A serious law. That changes all over the world. It depends on where you at. And that's the law against the spirit of men. See. Men has been falsely accused of all kind of sexual things and they have been accused properly. But what is the law? What is God's law? Why is it in some places it's legal if you're 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21? See, man made those laws best suited for his growth. But ask yourself, in the animal kingdom, when God said be fruitful and multiply, when it's breeding time, see, and that's for all animals all over the world. See, when God clicked that switch, when God say, hey, I made you bleed, not breed. See, you don't go by what man say. Man make law for himself. Remember, Jim Crow laid down some bad shit for your ass. Hitler laid down some bad... A lot of things were done that were not right. Were done according to man-made laws. See, was done in court of the other color of law. Not the law of the land. The law of the land is everyone is indigenous. Everyone can live free. Who owns the land? See, that's where America, the Europeans of America, tricked the rest of the what they call foreigners, but they were really the true Americans. Because you got tricked. See, when they came over here, the first thing they asked you, who owned the land? See, the natives of this land said no one owns the land. We are a nation of people. We are a tribe of people. No one owns the land. And they kept, the Europeans kept pressing it. No, someone has to own the land. 
No, no one owns the land. Okay, well, if y'all say no one owns it, we do. So now since no one owns your land, I own it. And I'm coming over here to tax you. And I'm going to tax you as long as you own this land. Since you don't own it, you don't want to own it. See, and I'm going to come up with a law. I'm going to come up with a major law for you. Ignorance to the law is no excuse. And see, we're going to make sure that we make law so complicated that none of you niggas will know what the law is. And we will be able to wordplay and manipulate you all the way through our system. And when I say none of you niggas uh, understand our law niggas is ones that don't understand the law it's just the ignorant ones the ones that don't know you could be white black chinese japanese vietnamese if you don't know this american law they gonna screw you anyway you have never seen a system that the whole system is against the people that made the system, that votes for the system. You create a system, elect a system, vote for a system, then if you caught up in the system, ain't nobody in there fighting for you. Not your uh, public pretender or none of that. They call him a public uh, defender, but he's a public pretender. Because they, they all work with what is called a bar association. We go to the bar at night, have some drinks, talk about who we screwed over in the courtroom, what case you gonna let me win, what case I'm gonna let you win, who we gonna lock up, who we not gonna lock up. See, right now we playing God. See, they voted us in. They can't govern themselves. So they say, well, well we'll put the, them to be the gods over us. See, a lot of times you voting for people, but you don't even have the control of their actions. See, you voting for people and, and you don't, you, you, their actions and their deeds will take you to hell. Because you know it damn sure will take you to jail. Be conscious of your surroundings, your environment. Don't be quick to jump on anybody's bandwagon. And see, the problem with a lot of people is y'all quick to get on somebody else's boat to take a cruise. That's what got your ass over here in that situation in the first place. I can tell you how to capture a bunch of ignorant-minded people Get a big ass boat ship and give away free liquor, free weed, free drugs, and free fried chicken. And trust me, it'll be jam packed. You'll capture it. All the ignorant minded mother scratches each of my chocolates that you want to. <laughs> I came to y'all in love. I leave you in peace. I'm out. <laughs>